Autonomous vehicles are an innovative emerging technology which will very soon become deeply integrated in our society. Having autonomous vehicles on the road will enable safer, more efficient travel for millions of people. There are already various levels of autonomy present in many commercially available cars, including anti-lock braking, cruise control, and parking assistance. But the leap from these autonomous behaviors to completely autonomous driving is extraordinarily large and presents a host of technical challenges. One well, of the biggest concerns with autonomous vehicles is the steering control. It's not particularly difficult to design controllers to make an autonomous car follow that. There are plenty of cars out there that can already do that. However, when you ride in one of those vehicles, it's usually a bumpy, uncomfortable ride. This is because a steering controller is constantly making rapid adjustments in order to stay close to the desired path. This method of following a path is inherently very different than how humans drive. I spent this summer researching methods of improving steering controllers to create a smoother, more comfortable ride. Sophisticated controllers generally require lots of computational power and advanced algorithms. At the suggestion of my advisor, I worked on developing a system that would allow us to design such controllers for our test bench, the CAT vehicle. This system sets up direct communication between MATLAB and the CAT vehicle via JAWS, the CAT vehicle's communication architecture. Prior to this project, developers would need to write low-level code in C++ in order to control the car. However, the work I did this summer allows us to control the CAT vehicle directly from MATLAB. My experience conducting research in the CAT Vehicle RU was truly eye-opening. I never thought that such a narrow field of research like steering control would be so rich in exciting, unanswered questions. Because autonomous vehicles have the potential to make such a positive impact on our world, it's important that we continue to ask these challenging questions and get our hands dirty digging for the answers.